Hey yo guys, it's Karma back with another video. It's been four months or so, but we're back with Vox Blit, the best game ever, the best game ever. All right. Um, but in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to get all the rifts location. All right. So basically, once you complete the frog rift quest or the vineyard rift quest, and you talk to Pip, he gives you this new ability that you use. Is at bottom of my screen, and it's able for you to teleport to shrines and most people actually don't know this but there are actually four other ones or other shrines i forget but i'm gonna show you guys all the locations of them so that you can use them to teleport because that's the whole point of them. the part that kind of is lame is that it's there's a 10 minute cooldown it used to be uh 20 minutes but anyways i'll show you guys these locations and if you're level 20 and watching this video i'm guessing you guys already know the map so hopefully I don't have to do much explaining, but we're going to head over to the magic place or I forgot what it was called, the Ma oh, Magnus place. Head over to the Magnus place because that's where the first location is. Once you have entered Magnus, then uh, head over to the back of the corner, actually. Because there is a ladder that leads up to the shrine. It's a pretty sneaky one. All these shrines are put in plain sight almost, but are hidden still. Okay, I'm lost. It's right here. The ladder is right. I'm up here. There's that magic shrine. But for this one, you actually want to head back to the Overgrown Forest. Uh, I don't know if you guys know about this, but the cave between Overgrown Forest and Floral Fields, that cave, that is where the well, that's where the second shrine is. So this is the cave I was talking about, but gonna get really dark so hopefully you guys will be able to see it all right so go to the right and then there should be a little cave in the wall a little hole in the wall go down it and then once you reach this like corner you're gonna want to look for this blue stuff on the wall and this mushroom and then take that route and boom second coral finds right here and then you could leave floral places over here which i've taken this route so many times and i've that that like i didn't even know there was a there's another path in there it's crazy i mean because it's so dark so there's that one uh let's head over to the tundra now All right, now just follow me uh, if you don't know your way through tundra all right so you're gonna whoops sorry you're gonna take first right then you're gonna go up here like that and like that and right and right 
boom here so you got these steps past the steps go crack right here walk into this and boom another crack in the wall. and there it is from here we're gonna just jump down to the swamps so i'm just gonna make our way back to the start All right, we're in bog town. Okay, I'm gonna keep going to the left towards the frog rift, right? Towards the person that gives you the bog frog or man, the frog quest. Sorry, I don't know what they're called. You wanna go behind this mountain, right? Because then there is there's a form from the mountain. Climb up it. Ladder. All right, climb up it. And eventually another ladder, and then eventually some more stairs, and then have the shrine. Boom, guys! I apologize. There was another. Uh, there was another shrine that I forgot. I did know about it. I just forgot that I didn't unlock it, and I unlocked it on a different slot. So I thought I had it this entire time. But it's the hex one. I apologize. So basically, all right. If you guys don't know already, there's one more shrine at the hex hex guild location. So I'm heading there right now. Um, headed on my way to the desert inn, and then headed to the deadlands. Hopefully, you guys know where that is. But uh, I apologize. So there's six. I, I I freaking knew it. I was like, I'm. I think I'm missing one when I started recording. Excellent one didn't come to mind. Anyways, so head over to the Hex Guild location. And if you guys don't know, you guys just follow me. Head over to the Desert Inn. Hopefully you guys know where that is. So. And then uh, take you guys from there. All right, in the Deadlands drop down, all right, stick close to the right wall right there. And um, you guys will eventually run into a crack in the wall. But uh, it's past this like dead root thing on the stairs. And then right around this corner is the crack. And it gets really dark, so you guys gotta be really careful, okay? Just, I'll tell you guys crack location so for the bridge all right you guys just run over the cracks all right there's a crack right here jump all right run 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 this part you gotta be kind of be careful because it'll be a drop off over to the left and drop down then boom there's a crack be careful about that one now you're here and then here's the here's the hex guild right you guys can walk out walk forward and boom the shrine i forgot to unlock on this slot and now you guys are all set and to get out of here you just walk back over to the church boom ladder be careful not to oh wait yeah you can fall if you get oh yeah there we go now that is the last location and that is all five shrines i'm believe i know these are these are all the five shrines um and you guys can teleport to all of them now. And these will come in handy. And if you guys did not know these locations, drop a like, man. It's been a minute since I made a video. But I'm so passionate about Voxel Blade that I just needed I just needed to make a video on Voxel Blade. But more to come out, alright? More to come out, more hacks, more tips, more 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 tutorials or helps. I don't know. But that's it guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in another video. Peace!